Okay. My name is Miracle. I attend Northwest High School. Cheers, boy! Give me a rhyme. You sound white. Now that I think about it, you act white too. What percent white are you? Actually, I'm 100% black. I'm boring. I don't have another ethnicity's blood running through my veins. I'm black. I have the Capri Sun and Kool-Aid from the picnics and the family reunions piercing through my body. Then they ask, why do you talk like that? You mean talk properly? That's the way I was raised. I don't go around singing inappropriate grammar. You feel me, dog? That's spelled D-A-W-G. I mean D-O-G, sorry. But I wake up every morning to go to a school, which I hate. I have to sit next to kids who pass hate back and forth like I'm not sitting right there, but they don't see me because I'm a joke to them. I have to go to classrooms where every day is the first day. They ask me to sit here and talk to kids who bully me and tell me I'm not good enough. No, I'm not black enough. I grew up in the hood across from the projects. Gunshots lay at the sky like stars, but they wouldn't know that because I'm built white. Like black people are built with guns in their hands. I get out the ghetto and y'all judge me for that. But that wasn't my choice. When your mom dies in the house you lived in, you wouldn't want to stay either. Y'all judge me based on the way I talk because I don't talk ghetto. I don't go around selling cars with y'all, selling drugs with y'all, talking like I wasn't raised right with y'all, so I have to be white. You will not tell me what I am and what I can't be because I'm black. No, I'm sorry because I'm white. Stereotypes have been taken to level two. You don't base your judgment on my skin anymore, so you think you have rose up from the ashes and that you aren't racist anymore. But I can't be smart because I have to make my living off of a hood rat because I'm not white. Which one is it? Be the blessed black woman I can be and show everyone that we are more than just gangs and drugs or fall into the stereotype and get pregnant right before I graduate. No, let me tell you something. I will walk across that stage with a cap and a gown and I will not have a belly. The only thing I get about me being black is, you're pretty for a black girl. If I was this so-called white girl you call me, would I be pretty for a white girl or would I just be pretty? The last time I checked, that's not a compliment. But I wake up to go to a school that I hate and be placed into a stereotype that I didn't think was mine. Black Lives Matter, you say? Guess mine doesn't. Right.